You bring in Donna here. You, you've got this organisation, Urban Zen. You've worked with the Clinton Global Initiative to build homes in Haiti. The model for the developing countries is their soul and their spirit. Mm. And I said, you could look at this as negative or you could look at it positive. And I think the people were quite shocked when I went down originally. Because if I came out with a very simple way of doing it, and then I saw every person there as an artist. So what I was able to do is work with the artisans, to work with the hortisans. Everything here I'm wearing is made in Haiti. Really? I mean, shockingly. These are horn bracelets. These, this story is spectacular. A woman went down to adopt two children. So what did she do? She adopted a village by recycling paper and making these beads. Then I had come in and worked with her in coloration. You know, recently developing paper mache bags. You know, having the opportunity to work with this type of creativity, I really believe it's the model and tell for me, how developing do they, world. How are they responding to this kind of thing? You know, it's not as easy as I thought. You know, uh, but I do know that there is an answer here. You know, I was so excited that I finally put it on the runway at the Donna Karen show. So I was able to show the people, don't give up, unless we put philanthropy and commerce together, which I believe... Which is exactly what President uh, Kagame was saying, is that the UN and this national community can go so far, but actually in the end, you do need to have the people of Rwanda, of Haiti, being inspired and helped and encouraged to rebuild from within. President Martelly, you're, you're the man, you're the man in charge of the government there. You've heard what the man from Rwanda says, he's been through all this. What do you think? First of all, uh, the Rwanda model is a model that we're following very close, closely. First of all, we need to identify what we want to do. For instance, let's say we're going to uh, work with coffee. We work with coffee and make the best out of it uh, to the point where we can again export coffee. Back in the years, we paid our independence with coffee. It was worth $21 billion.